Hello, everybody. Um, I've been asked by one of my prescribers to uh, do a little blog on about my work. Well, uh, my work is on like um, on litter maintenance, so I do like the litter picking. Um, I do general litter picking around uh, my workplace. Uh, I also empty the bins around my workplace. And there is uh, seven bins around the outside of our workplace. Uh, so I have to make sure that none of them are full up and uh, I have to empty them. Uh, and put a new bin liner in them. I do what they call a trash walk. Um, and I go around the complete building, under the flyover area, uh, over like by the shops. Because uh, generally, we, cause like where I work, we like stuck, slam bang, right in the middle, right in the middle of the place. And then, so like basically, we're here in the middle here. And then we got shops to our left, and we got shops to our right, and we got a flyover which is over the back of the building. And like we got some dry bits uh, where people park up wait for their orders to come through and uh, yeah so uh, I do mainly that and I also do inside make sure the back is nice and tidy um, check stock at the back make sure that it's like already for the uh, workers, the crew, to come and get what stock they need uh, and make sure all the boxes are undone, ready for them, just to grab what they need to take out the front. Um, I also I, uh, do the bins in the office. Uh, I also do the bins in the crew room. Um, we make sure that the crew room is tidy, make sure the back room is tidy, and it, uh, for when people come out, um, I also change the cages for the uh, cardboard boxes. Um, once the cover box is for a uh, cage with the cover box to fill up, uh, we also take the oils over, the oil barrels that is it, over like if um, they're full up, then we have to seal them down and put a cage door on the cage with the oil inside and take it over ready for the delivery to pick up and take and give us another barrel. Um, I also help out occasionally with deliveries by bringing the cages down <coughs> and putting them into the back room while the uh, delivery workers put it away in the uh, chiller, the freezer and in the storerooms and uh, yeah, so there you go, it's a little bit of what I do, and uh, uh, we do do a lot more than that, but like, that's just generally what I do, 
Okay. Well, that's enough about my work. Um, hope you um, are all enjoying the new year. I know this lockdown is um, going to start affecting people quite badly. Um, I did hear the other day that we've gone on to tier 5 now. But how true it is, I don't know yet. But um, I did watch um, a YouTube video with uh, Boris, which he done, um, a broadcast, uh, saying that we're going to have a harder lockdown this time. And uh, so when the actual lockdown is actually starting, I'm not sure. Uh, as far as I knew, it was supposed to start a couple of days ago, but it doesn't seem like it has, to be honest. I mean, uh, we're supposed to be in a harder lockdown now, and like, um, I can't understand it. And it, because shops are still open. Uh, restaurants are still open. Well, they're not open to people sitting in, but they're open to people, like, for deliveries and walk-in orders and, like, sort of, like, takeaway orders, basically, where they can walk in, make their order, and then wait for their order and then take it away. Um, that's opening, that's happening with most takeaways now. Some of them have got, like, some takeaway places have got, um, a built-in window where they, uh, people stand at the window and they make the order by the window and then the people inside make, do the order and then they pass it through the window. And they, and they get paid, obviously. They get paid by cash. It doesn't matter because, like, the people that take the cash are wearing gloves. <coughs> and they're for their own safety as well as, like, the customer's safety. Um, but, yeah. I mean, there's still loads of people walking about with no masks on. And, um, right, what can I say? But then, like I said, like, uh, with me, as you know, what you see is what you get. And it, because I don't use all these fancy gadgets and fancy words, because I don't know. <laughs> to be honest, I don't know. Um... But from what I do know, that's all I can tell you. Uh, but my opinion is uh, there's still quite a lot of people not taking the lockdown serious enough. And it, um, and in what? In Essex, should I say Essex? Uh, Essex. Buzzardham, Pixie, Wakeford, Billericay, South End, uh, name it, a lot of places in Essex. Uh, there's been a high, very high level of uh, COVID-19 in a lot of people. And, it, and um, it's not getting any better. From what I can make out at the moment, it's getting a lot worse, so it's going to get a lot better before it gets better. I mean, the vaccine, 
the walk my cat is being paused up, paused there. <coughs> So they're open to section 8, Andrews, it's not fair since the people with this uh, fetching that they've got. Um, so, uh, but I don't know, does this fetching actually work? I mean, is the vaccine stopping people from getting COVID? COVID? Is it actually stopping them? And it, or is it just delaying? And it uh, delaying the virus? I don't know. See, I don't know what. Uh, to be honest, I do not know. All I know is um, a lot of people are having it and it seems to be curing uh, a lot of the problems. Um, it seems to be working for numerous, numerous people. I don't know that a fancy word. Numerous. <laughs> I don't usually use that word. It's working for a fair amount of people. And it, um, it's protecting them. Uh, so. Uh, but. You know, um, I think they're trying to get this vaccine out there as much as possible. And as quick as possible to as many people as possible and then to save a lot of lives so and I know it is it will be hard work uh, with uh, doing all this because like um, I mean hospital is getting chock a block now and like you know, because there's not just hundreds of patients, there's thousands of patients. And they're waiting for the vaccine. So anyway, that's my that's just my view on it. And then give me your opinion on it. Tell me what you think of the lockdown. You know, but like basically, um, so I like me just saying what I think about it. But there's also you people out there. What do you think about it? And it do you think it's working? Uh, do you think it's going to take time to work? Or do you think no? It's all a waste of time. I don't know. I mean, like, basically, you know, I want to hear your opinions. So, hit that like button if you like my videos. And also, uh, subscribe to my channel. And leave a comment below. Let me know what you think. Right. I'm going to leave it there, okay? As I always say, before I go, your friend George, and we're out of here. Bye.